welcome back to Math Dogs. If you're new to the channel, please comment, like, and subscribe. If you have any questions, please comment down below. Problem number one asks you to write the equation of the line in standard form. So this is given to you in point slope form, which is y minus y sub 1 equals slope times x minus x sub 1. It's a very easy form to be able to enter in to write the equation of a line because all you need to do is know a slope and a point. And you can start with the point slope form. But many times the answer needs to be in standard form. And standard form is ax plus by equals c, where a, b, and c are all integers, and a is larger than 0. So a has to be positive, and you don't want any fractions or decimals as your coefficients a, b, and your constant c. So we're going to take and transform this equation, y minus 5 equals 3 times x minus 4, into standard form. So we'll start by the distributive property. y minus 5 remains on the left side of the equation. 3 times x is 3x, and 3 times negative 4 is negative 12. So now I have the y on the left side, just like it is in standard form. However, the x term is on the right side. So I'm going to subtract 3x from both sides. So that gives me negative 3x plus y minus 5 on the left side, 3x minus 3x is 0, or as some people say, it cancels out, and 0 minus 12 is negative 12. Now I'm going to add 5 to both sides to put all the number constant terms on the right. Negative 5 plus 5 is 0, leaving me with negative 3x plus y equals negative 7. So I'm almost there. I have my x term plus my y term equals number, but a has to be positive or larger than 0. So I'm either going to divide both sides by negative 1 or multiply both sides by negative 1. It's going to have the same effect. All of my signs are going to reverse. So I would get positive 3x, negative y, and positive 7. Putting my equation in standard form, I have 3x minus y equals 7.